Hello and welcome to Numeristical, bringing you the picks of the day for Tuesday, May 28th. Um, it's not quite 7 in the morning here, California time. Uh, let's get started, as always, by reviewing the picks from yesterday. So, uh, we had one money line pick was the Mets, and that got rained out, so we don't need to think about that one. Twins and the Royals did go over. Uh, the model really liked this pick. It was actually a late inning pullout. It was at exactly seven runs, and uh, the Royals scored a bunch of runs in the top of the ninth to push it way over. Um, so that was nice. We picked up 0.92 units roughly, and so we're now up 0.61 units for the season on the totals and money line models. Uh, for the spreads, we had the Padres minus one and a half. They won by one, left a lot of people on base, could not get that extra on that we needed. So unfortunately, we took a loss there. On the spreads model, we're down 2.61 units for the season. Let's move on to the picks for today. So we've got a full set of games today, including uh, a double header between the Dodgers and Mets. Um, and again, we don't have them all listed here because some games still don't have a pitcher listed. Um, going through our filters, uh, it's telling us to look at, you know, again, this is really two, two home teams and one away team. So there's some confusion with the thing. Um, because of the double header, the odds get joined up uh, sometimes weirdly. So uh, the first game, again, some of us to look at is, as always, it likes us to bet on Jose Quintana for the Mets. So uh, it's saying to bet at 109 or better and Pinnacle showing 129. So this, this always seems to be the case when Jose Quintana pitches. Um, let's take a look at uh, the odds on Wager Talks. So we got to find the Dodgers Mets up here, the Jose Quintana game. And you see we can get plus 135 here at South Point um, for the Dodgers Mets. So we will do that. So let's mark that down. Uh, Mets plus 135. Uh, Mets, Mets plus 135. Okay. The next game it wants us to look at is the Cardinals and the Reds. It likes the Reds, thinks they have a 58% chance of winning. And with enough of an edge, it says it's good to bet them. Uh, right, so the model is saying bet it at minus uh, 113. Um, if you can find that pinnacle showing minus 122, let's take a look at what we got on the Reds. Um, and not quite getting to minus 113. The best we see is minus 122. So uh, we'll not take that pick today. Finally, uh, this class now pick is uh, it's saying take the Dodgers if you can get the same line as you can get on the, the other game. Uh, so that's not a bet today. Um, the final game is the Nationals and the Braves. Uh, Braves are big favorites, 66% according to the model. But they're saying, you know, if you could get the Nats, then at 248, it's worth a bet because enough value. Pinnacle showing 223, probably a stretch, but let's see if we can get the Nationals at 248. No. So again, we're seeing circus 225 but not quite getting the, the big edge that the model wants to take a bet. So we will not take a bet there. So it looks like for money lines, we just have the Mets. Uh, moving over to totals, here's the full list of totals games for today and probabilities. Um, and it's telling us to look at two unders and five overs. Um, so the first under that it likes is the Reds Cardinals, under nine and a half, if you can get minus 104, showing minus 115, so this might be tough. But let's take a look, Reds Cardinals, under nine and a half, click over to totals. Nine and a half under, and we're seeing minus 110, it's circa, um, but, 
not quite getting uh, what we want, which is uh, minus 104. So won't take a bet there. Next up, Angels Yankees likes under nine, but wants better than even money. So again, this will probably be a stretch, but let's take a look. Uh, Angels Yankees uh, and wants under nine at plus 104. And you see for under nine, the best we're getting is minus 105 at Superbook. Um, so not going to find a bet there. Interesting that Superbook and Circa, I mean, the, the, the underpriced here is minus 105, the overpriced here is 100. So you're, you're almost getting close to a potential arbitrage situation. So I suspect one of these lines will move uh, fairly soon. Um, but that's it. So let's move on to uh, the overs. So Red Sox Orioles likes over eight if you can get even money. Red Sox Orioles. And over eight, we're not going to get even money. You see, circus has gone eight and a half. You get even money of that. So, no bet there. Um, yeah, this is where Red Cross, this must be a miss. Something, again, got confused. Hold on one second. Let me just check something. Okay, I had some weird snafu where the, it lined up, it also, it was giving me the Reds Cardinals at an over seven and a half. I don't know where it got seven and a half from. Uh, we can just take a quick look and see that there's no seven and a half on that game. So I don't know why something got confused there. Um, next up, Braves Nationals likes over eight and a half. It wants plus 110 though. So probably not going to get that. We're probably looking for an eight on the Braves Nationals. And yeah, we're not going to see an eight. You can see eight and a half over. So we do get even money at Circa. Um, but this one's considerably better than that. Next up, White Sox Blue Jays likes over seven and a half. Again, one's better than even money. Let's take a look. Seven and a half. Yeah, no even money there. No bet there. And the Mariners Astros. Uh, Actually, this one looks like we'll find a bet. So it's saying take the over seven and a half. Um, if you can get uh, better than minus 112, and we're actually showing minus 102. So let's take a look there. Uh, Mariners, Astros, seven and a half. And we can get even money uh, at several places Circa, South Point. Caesars all shown seven and a half even money at online. And uh, yeah, so let's do that. Let's take the uh, uh, Astros Mariners over seven and a half at even money. Mariners over 7.5 at even money. Okay, um, so that's our one bet for the totals. Um, let's take a look now at uh, at uh, spreads. Um, so again, spreads. Some of them are getting kind of confused, but uh, we'll just be careful. So the uh, again, let's look at the Dodgers Mets. If the Mets plus one and a half, uh, let me show the whole the whole list of games. Um, and I'm sorry, I'm going to show the probabilities that people like to see. Um, and uh, so Mets plus one and a half, it's saying bet it at minus 142. And it looks like we could see it at 130. So. Let's go over the spreads. Um, Mets plus one and a half. Um, you can see, oh, it's slashing. You can get 
even minus 128. And it sank to bed at minus 142. So that's a bet. Again, uh, you always want to think in reality if you want to bet a team twice, both uh, straight money line and spread. But uh, we'll just go ahead since this is just for fun. We'll put the Mets down plus uh, plus one and a half is the Mets. I should clarify that with Jose Quintana. Um, minus one third. Uh, minus, we got better. We got minus one, 128, minus 128. Plus one and a half, minus 128. Plus one and a half, minus one twenty-eight. And I should clarify this is uh, uh, Mets. Was that Quintana? And I'll dip it over here too, and just to make sure we know. Um. Okay. Next up, Red Sox and Orioles. Uh, it's saying take the Orioles minus. Uh, minus one and a half if you can get 133. Uh, Orioles over here. Not seeing 133, size 127, so we won't put a bet there. Um, Reds again, it says uh, take minus one and a half. Reds minus one and a half if you can get 163. And let's take a look at the Reds. Again, close 160, 160, but not seeing 163 anywhere. So um, we will not take a bet there. Um, Astros Mariners likes, uh, again, the Mariners minus one and a half, um, but wants 185, which is a stretch. But let's take a look. Mariners. Uh, here we go, minus one and a half. Um, and we're looking for 185. Yeah, so we're not going to get there. You see the 165, but not 185. So no bet there. And then again, this class now one is not a real one because it's looking at the wrong odds. So then we got the Yankees. Uh, Yankees minus one and a half if you can get minus 103. And then let's take a look. Yankees minus one and a half. Not getting minus 103. Getting minus 105 a couple places. But not minus 103. So it doesn't look like we're going to get any spreads bets for today. So, uh, oh no, I'm sorry. We had the one spread says the Mets. Plus one and a half, minus 128. We also have the Mets, again, the Jose Quintana pitching game. Plus 135, straight money line. And then the Astros Mariners over seven and a half at even money. So those are the choices for today. Thanks for joining me. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.